even today there's a gender bias in education pay and healthcare where women are dismissed misdiagnosed or treated wrongfully to top it all some governments have stepped up dutifully to control women's bodies the right of a woman to make decisions about her own body is at the very core of a fundamental right to equality if anyone's listening while india has lately doubled down on the two finger test ban abortion rights and by recently acknowledging marital rape as rape other governments have regressed a few centuries the middle east is notorious for its women's rights violations prominent being mahsa amini's death at the hands of iran's government officials why she wasn't wearing her hijab properly it seems but this happens to only a few right western nations provide full equal rights to women um actually that's not true where a who study found that 225 million women don't have access to essential modern contraception us supreme court overturned roe v wade last year and limited american women's right to abort in certain us states first world countries like denmark france belgium and switzerland have banned the burqa worn by muslim women an indian state too attempted to rule against women's choice to wear a hijab to school in turn affecting their education but here's the harsh truth a study found that most women face discrimination in their right to access health services leading to maternal mortality why because women's bodies are politicized in fact according to a world bank report no country gave women equal legal rights up until a decade ago let that sink in let us leave you with a fun fact did you know that there are only 12 countries in the world which offer full legal protection to women that's lesser than the countries that play in the fifa tournament just saying